Hey guys, so today I have swatches of the Essie Winter 2016 collection. There are six polishes here. I think I got these from sparklecanada.com, but um, this was a while ago, so they should be available on other e-tailers right now as well. So six polishes in this collection, and I'll get into the swatches. So the first polish is called Go With The Flowy, and this is a light, almost white gray with a silver shimmer. So here is one coat. This one is a little sheer and a little bit streaky on that first coat. Good formula on this one though. So here is two coats. So this one covers completely for me on two with a little bit of a thicker coat. I do think depending on your application you might still have some streaks on the second coat. And that second coat is a little bit more difficult to level out. The shimmer is there but it's not super obvious and this dry is a little bit dull as well. So there is two coats of Go With The Flowy. The next polish is called Oh Behave, and this is a lighter, kind of dull pink with a strong gold, slightly gold, slightly orangish shimmer. So here is one coat, and this one is a little bit sheer on that first coat. Formula is good on this one, and the shimmer is really strong. So here is two coats. So I can still see my nail line a bit on the second coat with this one. There are also some brush strokes in that shimmer. Most of those do go away as it dries, but some of them will stay there. So here is three coats. This one covers completely in three. I think if you're not super picky, you could get away with two on this one. There is three coats of Oh Behave. The next polish is called Getting Groovy, and this is a gold, like a yellowy gold foil. It is the same color as Essie's Good as Gold, but has a much more sparkly finish. So here is one coat, and this one is a bit sheer on that first coat. The formula is good. It does feel like it's easy to put on, but it feels like it wants to pull down the sides just a little tiny bit. So here's two coats, and this one does cover completely in two. Because this is more shimmer than glitter, it won't be difficult to remove off the nail, but some of those little sparkly pieces will probably stick to the skin. So there is two coats of Getting Groovy. The next polish is called Ready to Boa, and this is a kind of medium brown with a red shimmer. So here is one coat. And this one is just a little bit uneven on that first coat. If you did a little bit thicker of coats, you might be able to get away with this one in one. And it has a fantastic formula. So here is two coats. So two coats on this one does cover completely. That shimmer stands out really nicely, and there are pretty much no brush strokes through it after it's dry either. It does dry a little bit dull though, so you will definitely want top coat. So there is two coats of Ready to Boa. The next polish is called Party on a Platform, and this is kind of a medium red. It does lean a little bit pink to me. So here is one coat. And this one is just a little bit light on that first coat. Great formula on this one, though. So here is two coats. And this one does cover completely in two, and it matches the color that's in the bottle. And this dries is super shiny as well. So there is two coats of Party on a Platform. And the last polish is called Satin Sister, and this is a kind of medium teal. So here's one coat. And this one is a little bit sheer, has a couple streaks on that first coat. Fantastic formula though, and I do think if you did a thicker coat, you could probably get away with one. So here's two coats. And this one does cover completely in two. Like I said, I think a thicker one coat probably would cover completely, but I don't know if you'd want to do a coat that thick. And this also dries super shiny. So there is two coats of Satin Sister. So I have two favorites from this collection. The first one is Getting Groovy because it's just a really, really nice, super sparkly gold foil. And then I also really like Oh Behave because of that gold kind of contrasting shimmer. So that is the Essie Winter 2016 collection. I hope you guys enjoyed this one and I will talk to you later.